This image was taken by James Webb's near infrared camera, or near cam. The spectacular feature of this picture is this cartwheel galaxy. You can see, it looks different from a normal spiral galaxy. It has some spoke-like structures, which give it an unusual appearance of a wheel. This is not the first time we are witnessing it. The Hubble Space Telescope had also captured some details about it, prior to the James Webb. This is the image taken by Hubble, and this is the image by the James Webb. You have to understand, that this galaxy is located at about 500 million light years from us, in the Sculptor constellation. So Hubble's image is actually commendable. However, James Webb is equipped with extremely powerful infrared sensors. That's why we are able to observe this galaxy with such fine details. Now let's have a closer look at it. In this picture, there are three more galaxies besides this one. Two on the left, and one on the right. There are many more, but they are barely visible. The galaxies on the left are about the same size as the Cartwheel Galaxy. But they are located farther than this one. There are some distinctive features, which separate this galaxy from other galaxies. You can see a ring-like structure at the center. In fact, this is a site of hot dense gases and dust. It is an active region with continuous star formation. Now going to the outer edges, you can see a similar ring-like structure. The different colors you see in this galaxy indicate different types of galactic matter present within it. The outer edges is a place of continuous supernova explosions and star formation. That is why astronomers sometimes refer to it as the ring galaxy. Its outer ring is getting bigger and bigger. It may be expanding from about some 440 million years ago. The reason for its expansion and its unique structure could be a galactic collision. Some researchers suggest this was a regular spiral galaxy in the beginning. Then it collided with a relatively smaller galaxy and the result was this unique wheel-like structure. The shock waves from the collision has not died out yet. Matter from this galaxy is still moving to its outer edges, forming this colorful wheel. The reddish color is due to the presence of hydrocarbons and silica dust. The bright color at the edges indicate the presence of dense star clusters. So why is this galaxy important to us? Apart from its stunning visual aesthetics, this galaxy could be really helpful for studying star formation in distant galaxies. It is a unique galaxy we have found, considering the staggering distance at which it is located. The aftermath of the galactic collision is still apparent in it. It could be a favorite field of study for those researchers who are trying to understand the effects of galactic collision and galactic evolution. I think this is a great achievement for James Webb and for the astronomers. There is much to be explored and looked into in the upcoming future. Be sure to subscribe and share so that you will never miss any future updates. Thanks for watching.